we're back. I'm back. Episode 2. 1978 Sea Lark Rebuild Restoration. Call it what you want. We're gonna make this a nice fishing boat. In today's episode, you can see the boat's really clean. So let's cue really satisfying pressure washing video. <laughs> That's done and the boat is clean. It's all white again. It doesn't look like the swamp thing anymore. Look at this. We're gonna get all this stuff off the back. I gotta take the swim ladder off. We're gonna sand the back, sand the stripe off, get ready to paint the back black. And then I'm gonna airbrush on the Darth Vader emblem. And then we're gonna clear that transom, and get ready for the new motor. Haven't told you that secret yet. That was a sneak peek. All right, now that the brunt of the sanding is done with the 80 grit, I got the bottom paint worked down pretty good. Took some of the big stuff off. I'm gonna go to 220 grit, break this whole area in pretty even, and then 400 grit, and then if it would quit raining on me, look at that nice clean hand. If it would quit raining on me, I will uh, try to paint today. Get everything sanded. That was a bit of a pain because, oh, I got a blue, blue face. It was a bit of a pain because uh, 45 year old bootstripe, that's not something you use adhesive remover on. It's kind of like I tried pressure washing it off here. It's really hard and brittle, so that's why I just sanded it with 80 on the other side. And then they have a hard bottom paint over an ablative bottom paint. And the ablative bottom paint was so old, it wasn't ablating very much. But I was able to hog it off of there, get this thing ready for paint. I'm gonna look at the forecast and see if I can prep this for paint today. Cause it'd be nice to see that transom be black and ready for airbrush. Along with the pressure washing, I also had to do another thing and to fix that tire. It was actually really easy to do. I was able to just jack the trailer up, pull it over the seat, and fill it up there. It's gonna rain on and off basically the rest of the day. So let me show you what else we got going. See the deck is way cleaner. Console's still a little dirty, but I gotta get everything out of it and strip it. Front deck much nicer. A lot less sketchy looking. Things I've done, so I scored this backrest. It says Kobe on it, but I don't really care that much for right now. Put that up on there. Got the lower. Should look pretty good. Swim deck will obviously go back on. I'm waiting to pull everything back through until I'm pulling my new rigging for the new motor in. I'm gonna take off that junction block. Steering's coming out because I'm going hydraulic steering, and then I have to move that shifter down to the angled portion. Check out these eBay scores. Giant trim tabs. I'll just have to get a set of pumps for them, or uh, rams for them. But those things are gonna be humongous on the back of this. They're quite large, but they definitely should do the job. I'll show you how I'm gonna get them mounted on there to get the you know, best effect without causing drag when I'm not using them. And then the other big thing we have to do is get the fuel filler neck in and the fuel proper fuel line from the new gas tank back to where we're gonna have the engine rigging. So we'll do that and then we'll get that floor secured. That's it for today's video. I know it wasn't super eventful, this rain, it's it's sprinkling on me right now, it's hard to tell. But it's really kind of throwing off the whole getting the transom painted thing. I'm gonna try to get that done early this week if we have a clear day. That way next weekend I can be airbrushing and we can get you guys some better content. If you're asking me why I'm doing black on a 45 year old boat that I'm not gonna make perfect because it's a fishing boat, it's because it's the best color to airbrush on. I got big plans for the whole side of this. Both sides. Until next time. Be sure to subscribe. If you didn't catch the last episode, it's in the playlist. I keep I keep doing this. What is this? Okay, feel free to make fun of me in the comments. The Darth Vader getting pulled behind. Darth Vader. <laughs>